Hi, my name is Kenneth Wong. I'm a professor in psychology, and I'm also the current chair of the PhD program in clinical psychology. So I'm here to talk a little bit about empirical research. I'll share a little bit about why I like empirical research, how I find it fascinating, because it helps me understand and test certain hypotheses that I have about the world. For example, there was one time when I was curious about this dish called stinky tofu that many Taiwanese people like, but it definitely smells like poop, and wondering whether my American friends hate it or think it's gross is because of us being socialized or whether it just doesn't taste well. So I did an empirical experiment with my son. He was um, maybe about two, three years old then. He could talk. And so I thought he hasn't been socialized at this yet. So I gave him a piece of stinky tofu and wanting to see if he liked it or not. So I gave him a taste. He bit on it and he said, yucky. Why did you give me this, Dad? And as a researcher, my next question was getting a sense of what happened. So I asked him, why didn't you like it? And he said, this was too spicy. And then I noticed that it got a little bit that hot sauce on there. And then I realized, okay, it didn't fully answer my question because it was confounded by the variable that it was too hot, it was too spicy. So as a clever, logical person, the next thing I did was control for that confounding factor and gave him another piece that was without hot sauce and asked him again. And this time he still said he didn't like it. So I got closer to the truth. It seemed like it wasn't fully socialized. Someone who was yet socialized that something that smelled like poop um, was yucky, um, still didn't enjoy it. But of course, there's various factors in this um, practical experiment of mine. It could be that he wasn't in a good mood. So um, based on this, I think it's helpful to sort of design some research to, un to better understand what happens or certain hypotheses that we have about the world.